Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Tuesday, June the 8th, 2021. The tarot card for today is the Four of Swords, and this is from artist Lindy Longhurst. It is a deck in progress, and you can follow her at Lindy Longhurst on Instagram to see more of her deck and also her wonderful sculptures. And today, my friends, is all about the moon and abiding by the moon. As you begin the day, the moon is still in Taurus. And as we know, this is a little bit of a slower energy and a little more deliberate in its direction. Now, this card, the first thing it made me look to see was if we were going to have a void of course moon, and yes, we are, and it will mm, occupy probably the mid portion of your day because it won't be until later in the afternoon when the moon finally goes into Gemini. So if you hit a point where you feel like you hit a wall and things just kind of slow down for you or communication is definitely not working and everything you try feels, yeah, do like our figure here, go take a nap. <laughs> That's probably what I'm going to wind up doing because, you know, it is that needed rest and recuperation and the Four of Swords is a card of recovery. And, you know, the, the type of recovery that is here is sometimes that just, you know, regathering of yourself, right? You figure Mercury is retrograde, the moon is void, and things are probably just not going the way you need for them to. It's time to chill, all right? So it'd be a few hours out of your day. I forget, maybe four or six hours, somewhere in there. But it's enough to you know, just kind of regroup and take it easy. And you'll be surprised once the moon moves into Gemini, you'll be happy that you had that rest because you'll be ready to go. The Gemini energy is more scattered, you know, sending you in more than one direction at a time. So yeah, it's about four hours, three, four hours, I would say, that this void is going to last. And it hits you, you know, mid-morning, so, yeah, definitely nothing wrong with this. The, I know I put these out early, and some people occasionally ask me why, but I have plenty of people who, you know, it's already tomorrow by the time they're listening to it, of course. And they are in Australia, just like Lindy. But for those of you who have yet to begin your day, yeah, it gives you the heads up. You know, sometimes get up early, get things done early, get them out of the way, and, you know, take that four hours, put your feet up, do something more relaxing and more nurturing that's just for you. As I said, it's more of a restful, recovery type of day. It doesn't have to apply to the whole day, but I do feel that it applies to the void, of course, moon. So I want to thank you very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.